In Michael Jackson's final moments, he thought about blank. Ooh. Was Michael Jackson ever uh, convicted of anything? No, considered gay, or was he just uh, no? It, it was no, kind it was of just like pedophile. just pedophile. Yeah, okay. They were just calling him a pedophile. <laughs> yeah, I know the reason why he was calling pedophile. I was just wondering if they were calling him gay as well. No, mm. I don't think so. Okay. He had children. He had yeah, three but children. those were awesome. artificially inseminated. I did not know like, that. Yeah, he never. He never had sex with that woman. <laughs> <laughs> they were test tube babies. That's oh, really? which makes it a little weird. It's I mean that's that in and of itself is not weird. It's just the whole I don't know with him it was weird. He's a pedo and he made test tube children. That's, a, that's yeah. weird. <laughs> <laughs> oh come on. <laughs> <laughs> Michael Jackson's final moments. He thought about the art of seduction. Also, child abuse and racism. All three at the same time. You could uh, multiprocess very well. Yeah. <laughs> he was trying to seduce racist children um, <laughs> who were very abused in their childhood. Fuck. I'm going to have to go with this one. Yes. Mm. <laughs> I swear to fuck. Uh, Jim, you have the same humor as I do, apparently. Oh, God. I guess so. Life's pretty tough in the fast lane. That's why I never leave the house without making a pouty face. A squadron <laughs> of moles wearing aviator goggles and public ridicule. <laughs> never leave the house without public ridicule. <laughs> I just imagine walking out the door and you're just making the pouty face like, hmm. Yeah. Do that every day. Every morning you walk out the door. <laughs> every day. It's a little mirror. Yep. Yeah. You're like Zoolander. <laughs> I'm young, hot, and full of ejaculating live bees, and the bees are angry. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Why wouldn't they be? I'm young, hot, and full of the homosexual agenda. I'm young, hot, and full of poor life choices. The last one is very true for That's me. Very, very true. Very, very true. <laughs> um, I don't know how you can be full of ejaculating something, but I still <laughs> like it. <laughs> it's just those okay. long Nobody. ones. <laughs> how come we haven't come across the the card your mom yet? <laughs> is it no. is there a card called your mom? I thought there would be. I mean, I don't know <laughs> if there's actually. Or at least one similar to it. Yeah, I don't think there's a card that says your mom. Mm. Just your mom. I... <clears throat> In its new tourism campaign, Detroit proudly proclaims that it has finally eliminated the entire internet. The entire <laughs> internet. <laughs> it has finally eliminated Kim Jong-il. Ill. Yeah. Ill. It has finally eliminated almost giving money to a homeless person. <laughs> 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 almost. Just, just almost. <laughs> I feel like I always pick foes. <laughs> That's yeah. I and think Pixel if I, always if picks I, boredoms. <laughs> yep. <laughs> it's very cyclical. When boredom usually picks K, I think. Although some, it's a good chance of the time he picks. I uh, pick you boredoms. when you pick when you play cock. <laughs> <laughs> All right. You won't believe these fifteen hilarious blank bloopers. Mine's pretty accurate. Mine, I hope never happens. <laughs> you won't believe these 15 hilarious the clitoris bloopers um is this a porn site hilarious my first period bloopers oh. god that tape would be horrifying it's a movie <laughs> called the shining <laughs> 15 hilarious bouncing up and down bloopers uh, that depends on what's doing the bouncing <laughs> Hey, you didn't actually Did pick mine this time. Both said, I hope this never happens to me. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't say to me. <laughs> In his new action comedy, Jackie Chan must fend off ninjas while also dealing with former President George W. Bush. <laughs> while also dealing with Donald Trump. Same, same joke, pretty much. Yeah. While also dealing with a crazy little thing called love. Aww. George W. Bush. <laughs> <laughs> I don't really know what kind of um, mental picture Canadians have of George W. Bush, but I'm sure it's accurate. Stupid. Yeah. 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 <laughs> That's what we have. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
I feel like I'm wasting this one. It should be saved for later. <laughs> Turns out that taking your shirt off, man, was neither the hero we wanted nor needed. Where's the beef? <laughs> Turns out that passive aggression, man, was neither the hero we want needed or wanted. Turns out that seduction, man, was neither the hero we needed nor wanted. And now we're back to Michael Jackson. <laughs> <laughs> passive aggression. <laughs> I always pick foes. <laughs> He's getting really somewhere in this game. Yeah, I'm hot this round. All right. Not having sex may pass, but hospice care will last forever. <laughs> oh, that's that's kind of sad. <laughs> <laughs> An unforgettable quinceañera may pass, <laughs> but not contributing to society in any meaningful way will last forever. Meaningless sex may pass, but mild autism will last forever. <laughs> <laughs> Two of them about sex. Uh, um, I like this one. This one makes me laugh, and it's full hammers, of course. It I is. Feel, I like. I don't even. I don't know what I can play autism for. Then what can I get away? With? What's the crustiest? Oh God. Ooh. <laughs> I get a good, this one. <laughs> What is the crustiest? The moist, demanding chasm of his mouth. <laughs> Sucking all of the milk out of a yak. Oh. Or 1,000 Slim Jims. I, 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 I don't think this... any of these are crusty. Yeah. Um... Slim Jim yaks seem crusty. kind of crusty. <laughs> are yaks crusty? I feel like they have <laughs> eye crusties. I don't know. <laughs> I wouldn't know. I think we all just kind of threw cards out there. Seemed like it. And what did you bring for show and tell? An M16 assault rifle. <laughs> mm. <laughs> I feel like this card's too generic to be funny. <laughs> oh my god. And what Sheer did you cop. bring for show and tell? The tiger that killed my father? And what did you bring for show and tell? My first kill? And what did you bring for show and tell? Whining like a little beep. <laughs> <laughs> Whining like a little bitch. <laughs> um, this one. <laughs> oh <my> God. <laughs> Again. He's on a roll. Holy crap. <laughs> I got good cast Man. this time. <laughs> we never fails to laugh at a party. A spontaneous conga line, dead babies, or being on fire. I mean, we just can't catch you. Uh, yeah, thank you. You've got, to be, you. You've got <laughs> to be kidding me. Uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> A successful job interview begins with a firm handshake and ends with scrubbing under the folds. It, all, <laughs> it also ends with synergistic mm. management solutions. <laughs> True. And it also ends with being a motherfucking sorcerer. Ten points. Gryffindor. Gryffindor will always win. Oh, Canada, we stand on guard for... Blank. <laughs> have back for the first game. Oh, jeez. This is our national anthem, too. Yes. So. What's the actual line? Stand on guard for thee. Ah. The what? God. <laughs> I've had this oh. card in my hand, and I just want to play it. I've had it since the beginning of the game. Okay, we stand on guard for a monkey smoking a cigar. A sea of troubles or vomiting mid blowjob. That's all we do in Canada. We vomit mid blowjob. Hmm. What do you need to be on your guard for most? Uh, go with the sea of troubles? Yeah. Hmm. Okay. During Picasso's often overlooked <clears throat> brown period, he produced hundreds of paintings of. If, if there's not a poop joke, I'm going to be mad. I don't have any. <laughs> I think those two did because they played it almost <laughs> instantly. <laughs> During 
podcast is often overlooked. <laughs> <laughs> it's of, oh no, it's a minority. <laughs> Hundred paintings of filling a man's anus with concrete. <laughs> he produced hundreds of paintings of Italians. <laughs> man's anus. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. The token minority. Oh, shit. <laughs> <a> brown period. <laughs> he said brown, not black. Uh. What would Grandma find disturbing yet oddly charming? Brown people. Hurricane Katrina, date rape. She's a big fan of Greece. <laughs> <laughs> Sixteen Candles. Mm, yeah, yeah. It's her favorite movie. It's a pity that kids these days are all getting involved with blank. Damn it! That's where I could have used the Google. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yeah. It's a pity that kids these days are all getting involved with Samuel L. Jackson. With getting a shot of cannon. Oh, getting, sorry, getting a shot out of the cannon. <laughs> shot of cannon. Getting shot out of the cannon, yeah. Involved with being fabulous. Fabulous. I'm gonna go with Fabu. Hey. You gotta keep going, foe. You're letting Kay catch up. Oh, dear. <laughs> Need to start picking boredom killer. <laughs> 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 uh, learn the hard way that you can't cheer up a grieving friend with bullshit <laughs> can't cheer up a grieving friend with consultants or with parting the Red Sea <laughs> see this one oh, it's too obvious we're gonna go over here <laughs> are you <laughs> kidding me I have nothing in my hand I'm throwing these away and I keep getting them. What's the Canadian government using to inspire rural students to succeed? A bag of magic beans. The sweet song of sword against sword and the braying of mighty war beasts. <laughs> Jesus. <It's very> poetic. <laughs> it is. <laughs> Bill Nye the science guy. Um, I think this would be more exciting. Yeah. <laughs> I think this would get you, get you laid. Me specifically? Well, probably not you. <laughs> I guess. It will always get you laid. Pistol whipping a hostage. <laughs> it's hot. All these decorative pillows. <laughs> <laughs> Why else would you have them? <laughs> a brain tumor. That uh. would. <laughs> <laughs> you guys know me so well. <laughs> <laughs> Bow hammer. <laughs> Curses. Hang it. Uh. I like they used that on a girl too. It's like it wouldn't work for a man, but for a girl. Look at all these decorative pillows I have. <laughs> hey baby, you like these decorative pillows? Ooh. Yeah. <laughs> he who controls poor people controls the world. It's true. Yeah. He who controls Pandora's vagina controls oh. the world. <laughs> oh man. That's <laughs> everything comes out of her box. So that's just Pandora's box? Yeah, everything bad. He who controls vegetarian options controls the world. Oh <laughs> man. Oh man. Well, I mean you control amount of people. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> Step one. Fancy feast. Step two. Farting and walking away. <laughs> Step three, profit. <laughs> Step one, getting drunk on mouthwash. Step two, getting hilariously gangbanged by the Blue Man Group. Step three, profit. So your mouth and your body will be blue. Yeah. <laughs> Step one, hipsters. Step two, coat hanger abortions. Step Ooh. three, profit. I like this picture. Coat hanger abortions is a good card. Yeah, it is. <laughs> I don't care what the oh, other man. black card is. I had to play this white card. Okay. This is kind of accurate. A plague of a pizza guy who fucked up. <laughs> a plague of taking a man's eyes and balls out and putting his eyes where his balls go and then his balls in the eye. <laughs> I it's fucking love that card. That going on. Oh, I love that card. <laughs> A plague of the systematic destruction of an entire people in their way of life. Ooh. Well, I'm gonna pick boredom killers. 
Yes, thank you. <laughs> that other one was like too real. It was. Yeah. <laughs> I just love that card. That's my favorite card of the night. Yeah. <laughs> no. <laughs> Members of New York Social Elite are paying thousands of dollars just to experience advice from a wise old black man. And then a big black cock. <laughs> That's his advice. And experiencing quivering jowls. <laughs> That's what they get as well. As <laughs> it happens in that order, too. Yeah. Uh, uh, profit. <laughs> profit. <laughs> What's well, fun until it gets weird? Oh, Being a dinosaur. <laughs> Santa Claus. The boners of the elderly. <laughs> I'm not uh, convinced that at any point that's fun. <laughs> <laughs> but if they're in a choir. <laughs> exactly. I don't know. We're playing this game and it's pretty fun. But it does get a little weird. Um, yeah. It's weird less than a second later. Yeah. I have to go with this one. Yeah. I can't pick the boners of the elderly three times in a row. <laughs> <laughs> what will I bring back in time to convince people that I am a powerful wizard? Historically black colleges. <laughs> <laughs> Flying robots that kill people. The Harlem Globe Trotters. <laughs> what is that? The Harlem Globe Trotters? They're a team yeah. of they're a basketball team that do like amazing tricks in that. Oh, that's yeah. why I don't know. <laughs> Really? They're famous. <clears throat> yeah, they're in like Scooby Doo, they're in Futurama. They're in yeah. uh they're in everything. Well, they're I was too young to understand. You're older than I am. <laughs> I am? Yeah, you're you're older than I am. Oh. I don't remember. Anyways. <laughs> historically black colleges. Yeah. Coming down to Jim and yeah. Foe. <laughs> Part of his daily regimen, Anderson Cooper sets aside 15 minutes for slicing a ham in icy silence. That's <laughs> <laughs> so weird. <laughs> he sets aside 15 minutes for a mating display. <laughs> sets aside 15 minutes for Ryan Gosling riding on a white horse. He might actually go for that. Mm. <laughs> now, now where do you get Ryan Gosling? Oh, I'm sure there's a way. <laughs> uh oh. All right, Ryan Gosling, every day I need you to be Android. here for 15 minutes. Oh. <laughs> hey, you actually picked mine. <laughs> the curse continues, and it benefits me. <laughs> awesome. I could pick the potential winner here. Mm. When Bonzo you get it right, you. when you get right down to it, blank is just blank. When you get right down to it, Glenn Beck catching his scrotum on a curtain hook <laughs> is just wet dreams. <laughs> When you get right down to it, Nicolas Cage is just free feeding Rosie O'Donnell. All right? When you get right <laughs> down to it, whatever a McRib is made of is just really getting high. <laughs> <laughs> All right. And the winner is Foehammer. Right. Yeah. Mm, I was going oh, to choose man. the Glenn Beck one. Was that you, Jim? No. Oh, well. That's me. <laughs> Game would continue. Yeah. That's a good card, too. Actually. Yeah, it is. It goes um, well with wet dreams, because I think everybody wants that to happen. <laughs> Pretty much. <laughs>